stuff that aren't my normal routine but everything else basically is but something I like to do in the mornings is go to the gym in the morning because it's better for me if I get my workout in in the morning if I wait until later in the day I'm just not as motivated so I like to get it out of the way in the morning I normally do a spin class or yoga class or something or I'll just do cardio on my own which is what I'm going to do today I just feel like it's super important to get your body moving in the morning it's good for your body it's good for your mind good for everything so let's go get ready for the gym original original a gym fit plus a jacket because it's chilly outside gently me loving it she giving me Steadily, moving it, moving it gently. I like how you giving me steady. All done at the gym with my workout. Whenever I do cardio days, I I like doing classes better. I feel like when I have an instructor telling me what to do when I'm doing my own cardio, I just it just drags on. I feel like, but it's okay. It's over with. I do have a few errands to run, and then I realized I might want pictures in this like cute little workout set or something. But my hair right now, like. It looks so crazy, but luckily I have my Timo Porta cordless on the go hair styler. It comes in this really cute travel case, which I love. So basically it's just a hair straightener or hair styler that is cordless. Like this is all it is. It's so tiny. It can fit in your purse, a backpack, really any type of bag because of the design. So I just turned it on the highest setting and you can actually use this for up to 30 minutes on the highest setting, which is incredible. It only takes two hours to charge. So really doesn't take that long to recharge when you're home and then put it right back in your bag. I also don't have a hairbrush with me, but luckily this has 3D comb teeth, so it's going to kind of like brush my hair while it's styling it. I'm just going to take my hair out really quickly. It doesn't look too, too bad, but I do have some like creases in it from the hair clip that need fixed. I love that this enables a quick hairstyle switch anywhere on the go, which is so perfect. This would be perfect for traveling if you're at a mall with your friends date nights anything outdoors like really anywhere that you think you might need to fix your hair or if your hair gets really super frizzy this would be nice to have on hand just to kind of brush through it with the heat and fix the frizz this is honestly amazing for me because i feel like i switch my hair so often throughout the day from up and down especially with my hair being short now I just get so sick of it being down so then i will throw it up and then we're going somewhere and i'm like wait i kind of want my hair down now so yeah, this is honestly perfect. This is fixing all the creases in my hair and leaving it so like silky and shiny. I love it. I feel like this would be really great too for my girlies who work out before going to work. So if you're like a nurse or an office job or anything and you need to touch up your hair even if you're putting your hair back up but you wanted like front pieces out and they're not looking how you wanted them to anymore this is such a great tool for that i have it on the highest heat setting and it's getting pretty hot so i feel like even the lower heat settings would be perfect and then the battery life could last a little bit longer too but this is something that if you had in your bag 
like for girls night out or traveling anything your friends are going to love you because you can touch up everyone's hair with this just gonna touch up these front pieces one last time and now my hair doesn't have any creases or anything i won't look like a crazy person going to run all these errands and hopefully getting some cute photos in my little matching set i will link this down in the description below in case you want to get your hands on one but it's the time El porta cordless on the go hair styler <laughs> from the gym and running errands me and johnny always go to the gym at the same time because then we can ride together and that just makes the most sense honestly and then we ran the errands we had a few more that i didn't get to film but had to get some things done and then got home i had to put my hair back up because i am making our breakfast and i don't want my hair down when i'm like dealing with food and stuff you guys saw me make breakfast earlier and that's because i literally wake up starving like so hungry if i don't eat right away i i will literally get sick like it's so weird i have to eat as soon as i wake up so i always have a yogurt bowl or cereal or muffin or something like as soon as i wake up and then after my workout it's kind of like a later breakfast early lunch but i have to eat something else i also think being pregnant i'm just way more hungry than normal but this is normal for me having like two breakfasts i think i'm gonna make avocado toast and maybe like another toast so i have like two like avocado toast and like a strawberry jam toast or something like that and this is also the point of my morning when i finally get to have my coffee i don't want to have like so much caffeine in the morning before the gym and i also don't want to rush drinking my coffee because since i'm pregnant i can only have one and i want to enjoy it and just like sip on it so i just wait until after the gym when i'm home about to start work and everything so i can just enjoy my coffee Thank you, baby. You're welcome. Now is my favorite time of the morning. Time for coffee. I normally just make my coffees at home in the Nespresso versus like going out and getting coffee. I just have all of our little pods in this really cute glass jar. This is the very important part of my coffee routine. I always use this. It's the oatmeal cookie one. It's a dairy-free creamer. It's literally amazing. If you haven't tried it, you're missing out. And then I put a little bit of sugar-free butter pecan. This combo, these two together, literally amazing. And then I use my frother from Nespresso to make it really, really frothy. Pour some in. Pour a little bit of this. I love that this frother can do cold or hot frothing. So depending on if you're making iced or like a hot drink latte, then you can make your milk that temperature. So I'm doing iced today. I'm just gonna pour this in here and then add some ice. So then I usually bring my coffee out here, sit, relax, and then start working for the day. I'll just like go over my to-do list and then yeah, start working. Lately my work days have been editing photos and videos and shipping out Depop orders. I recently started my Depop, so now just like packaging those and getting those sent out and everything. I have a planner, but I honestly like to just do my um, to-do list on my phone like in my notes app and it's like really easy for me to just have it with me at all times whereas if i have a planner sometimes it's not with me if i'm like out doing things um so this is what is really easy for me but me and maybe love to sit out here it's so peaceful and calm and the chair is so comfy this is such a great spot to just like decompress after the gym and breakfast and stuff and just like figure out my to-do list and what i'm gonna be doing for the day 
and that is actually all that I have for this video my little morning video this is like basically my morning routine minus the errands and stuff that is like a rare thing like twice a week I'll be running errands but today I just had things that needed done thank you again to time Elf for sponsoring this video I will link my little portable straightener down below I decided I think I might keep that in my car like in the console because it's honestly so handy to have with you when you're out and about except when it needs charged of course but when it is charged just leave it in my console and so easy I love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next video bye